Hey, what is up, guys? This is Justin PNG, and we are back with some more Let's Play Minecraft. This is episode 13, and we are once again joined by that thing. If you. What the. Why are there two skeletons in my house? Um. Yeah, I cannot hear your audio at all. <laughs> So it, so we are trying to get that thing on the mic, but for some reason it will not let us include his audio. So if it sounds like I'm talking to myself throughout this episode, uh, it's me talking to him. By the way, when I asked what he would like to be referred to as, he literally just said that thing like he called me last episode. So now he's just that thing. That thing. JPEG. Whatever. Um, that thing has been playing on my realm a lot recently. He is... That, so that thing made an enchantment table. Uh, there's an anvil in that chest. Wonderful. Um, so there's a, an enchantment table right there. So in this episode, I'm going to be heading back to my spawn area. And I'm going to be building like sort of like a... Kind of like a welcome to the world. Kind of going to have a house there. With stuff in the chests to get people started. I'm just going to show you guys what I did off camera since episode 13. In fact, I don't even remember what I did in episode 12 at all. Um, so, the wall has gotten longer. I don't know if that was episode 12 that I did that, or if that was episode now, but basically the wall's bigger. got bigger at some point. And this is that thing's house, and I'm going to walk into it right now because I'm curious. Because he's made a little bit more progress on it. And why does this house look so nice? Where did he get the time for this? Um, but... Jesus Christ, he has a lot of stuff. I have to steal some of that. Okay. Oh, God, Squidward is in here. Oh, no, oh, no. There's a Squidward in your house. Yeah. I don't know. They just wanted to spawn in. He has a basement now. Um. Okay, Squidward, go away, Squidward. Uh, I don't know where that thing is right now, but it does not matter. He's probably doing his own thing this episode. This is a fountain. I'm pretty sure we all saw that fountain, though. Uh, I'm kind of just pointing out things that have already been obvious. So here's what I've been doing off camera. I've kind of been working on a bridge that will move towards spawn. And I'm not going to do the bridge on camera, and it's definitely not getting finished anytime soon because I'm trying to make the bridge decent, and I don't want to build like a dirt bridge. It kind of just goes across the ocean. We are not, uh, of course, using the bridge to get to spawn this episode. You can't even see spawn from the bridge. So instead, we are going to get on a boat, and we are going to go to spawn like that. And I have not been to spawn in a while. I think the last time I went to spawn is that episode where I was looking for a pumpkin and could never find a pumpkin because the game hates giving me pumpkins. That is an episode, by the way. Um, so we are going to start sailing away to spawn. Look at the village in the distance behind me. And yeah, so it's a pretty... It's a somewhat of a long journey as the my village fades into the background. So yeah. So that thing, what are you doing right now? He's trying to figure out if there is a way to do something incredible. More as the story progresses. I'm still probably just going to edit random audio clips that I can find online over when you're talking. Uh, we are at the spawn island, sort of. Islands. It's been a little bit since I've last been here. This is where the world started. This is where 
I could not find a pumpkin that one time. And that is the first tree I ever punched, and the leaves have not gone away. So over there is the f first tree I punched in this world, and the leaves have not gone away. For whatever reason, but this is... Simulation, this, this could be a factor in that, but still, leaves should be fallen. They have not fallen. We are going to build the house kind of over here. Once again, so this is kind of a nice area. I'm going to just throw this stuff away because I do not want this junk in my inventory. Okay. So we're just going to clear the area of tall grass. And this, I'm pretty sure, if I'm not wrong, I spawned like somewhere around there. Oh, if I see pickles for whatever reason. So whenever there's nobody else in the chat like that I'm talking to in the videos, this is just kind of what I talk about. I just kind of talk about sea pickles and why I think they're delicious and yummy. And, okay, I'm going to start building. So, basically, I'm going to start building like of these. Oh, okay, that's not how I want to build it. I don't know how much long I've been recording for. I am. I feel like I'm just taking me a while to get started here. I don't. Maybe this isn't a good spot to start. I haven't really thought anything through when it came to making this episode. Everything kind of just went wrong. You know, I had to renew the realm. Then, then, then the the, game, the voice chat wasn't working, and then, and then, and now, and now there's. People are cyberbullying me, and then I'm getting sued. See, now that I've mentioned it, the tree's actually starting to lose its leaves. All right. No, I think you're a simulation distance. All right, so we're going to build a little cabin. It's going to be a nice cabin. People are going to come here and they're going to want food and I'm going to be like, get your own food. Welcome to my world. But yeah. This is going to be one of the more awkward episodes. Not that it's boring, the most boring episode, but it's the fact that literally like I'm talking to myself. For real this time, I'm just talking to myself. Nobody else there, just me. Don't you have diamond armor in your chest? Why are you wearing leather armor? Why are you out here? Okay. What a strange fellow. Um, so... Why was he out here? I couldn't find him at his house. And then he's just out here at spawn. As the night falls onto my world, it gets darker. You know what I've been fascinated in this past week? Black holes. I've been watching lots of black hole videos, and part of me wants to build a giant black hole in this world. They should add black holes to Minecraft. It's a beautiful sunset. That's why we call this Sunset Island. Which is an unofficial name for my spawn. Oh, and now the sun's drinking. Oh, Lord. Okay, we're just going to find a spot to put in the door. I hear my cats running around upstairs. No. I I've just kind of stopped locking them in my room at night. Whatever the hell they want to. <laughs> so, I think last night, because I fell asleep on the couch last night, I woke up at 3 in the morning, and when I went up to my when I went up to my room, 
I noticed that nobody ever actually put the cats inside. So, and I was like, you know, it's it's three o'clock. I'm waking up in a few hours anyway. You know, I'm not gonna bother bringing the cats upstairs. I'm just gonna leave them. And you know, they were fine. But now they're just kind of running around, probably waking everybody up. Cause I can hear them from down here. Which reminds me, I left Nebula at my house. Which is probably for the better, because I'm pretty sure she's died like three times in the past week. So she's used up what? So she has like six more lives, I believe. Oh my god! Jesus Christ, the drown just walked into my house. I thought that was you for a second. <laughs> Just change your skin and everything, trying to fool me. Did he at least drop the shell? No, okay. I actually hope this house was a facing spawn, otherwise that would not be okie dokie. Um, where are you? Uh, sure. You do what you need to do. Oh yeah, I see an Enderman getting fought by- Good to know. I'm sorry, are you wearing iron armor now? What happened to the la There's no way you changed that fast. Right. I'm not even wearing armor, so if I fight an Enderman, I'm very likely to die. I'm just going to quickly go and place down a bed. Nah, nah, I was just sitting in my spawn. Alright, come here, Mr. Man. Enderman knocked on. Last time I died to an Enderman, the game cheated me out of everything. I won. I got an Ender Pearl. Yes. No. Nah. <laughs> I I kind of just turn off gamer tags because something about it annoys me. I don't know. Like I always see it pop up on my screen, somebody's gamer tag, and I'm just kind of oh no, that is a ba that is a oh god help! There is a baby zombie riding a spider, and then there is a drowned on a trident. Oh lord, this is how I die. I just destroyed my bed. Yeah, but I don't know. I always see like a tr uh, gamer tags kind of just in the side of my screen, and always scares the crap out of me. Like, what the crap is that? Gold armor. Gold. Oh, I died. Oh, hey, I'm almost out here. Yee I have two Ender Pearls in my inventory at this moment. You know, I don't like your skin. I'm just gonna, I'm putting it out there. I don't like it. I cannot tell the difference between an enemy and your skin. I thought you... Okay, I need to make my way back to the cabin so I actually make progress on it. So I got so confused earlier because I got a... There was like a group message sent out to some people from work. And I don't know who sent the message. Like the only person in that group chat I knew was John, and it was just like, and it was something about like a. Um... Huh. 
Yeah, it was about like an open shift for one day. And, um, sorry, how, why do you have so much armor in your inventory right now? Uh, I'm just talking to my friend, man. I j listen, man. So, I don't know. There was an open shift, and I'm confused. And I, I was confused because there was nothing on the app. I'm just assuming, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about, and and that's why I go. That's why I was confused because I didn't see that on the app, and I remembered I'm already working tomorrow, so you know. I don't know why I was in the group chat. <laughs> Little John, our John. I don't know. Maybe it's for the lesser peoples. I don't know. It was like me, John, and like two others. And then and then whoever sent the message in the first place. Alright, so I've somewhat made this place. Uh I'm gonna need to punch out areas for glass. And this is what I mean when I say night times are really long in this world. It was like sunrise when I started recording. And then and somehow most of the recording's been nighttime. You know, I think I should add, a, like, an upstairs and a balcony so you can look out at the sunset. But at the same time, you can already see this. Ah, the x coordinate of the village. Just, I don't know, it just keeps going up. I don't know. <laughs> like, it's probably 3,400. I felt the house a little bit unevenly. Hey, Sunrise! That's what I'm gonna name the village. Sunrise Village. Sunset Island and Sunrise Village. I did it. Because the sun rises in the direction of the village. I get it. I get it now. It's so perfect. Oh, and there's a skeleton waiting out here for me. Beautiful. Give me a helmet. So, like, there's, like, another month in the current Fortnite season, and I still don't feel like playing it. I think Fortnite should just give me all the levels for free. That's just what makes sense. Alright, I have no idea what this thing looks like. From the inside it looks nice, the outside it looks ugly, so I'm gonna have to make some staircases and build a sort of like a ceiling roof. I know, I'm just gonna hit that button. All right. That creeper better not follow me up here. It's daytime. I wish creepers burnt in the daytime. So here's a funny story. To those of you watching at home, uh, I we were out there. We I was gonna record yesterday, and then I fell asleep on the couch. Albie was ready to go, and I just fell asleep on the couch. Woke up at three in the morning, and I just fell asleep on the couch. You know, there's no other story there. It happens to the best of us. You know, like you just get home, you, you see a couch, you sit on it, 
and you're like, wow, this is a comfy couch, and you just kind of fall asleep on the couch. No, I just fell asleep. <laughs> well, I could, um, so approximately I got home at like 8.15, and then I ate something, so probably like, yeah, so I got probably like 9. <laughs> you know, <laughs> just... You know, I just like I just show up. I just, you know, I just, I just, you know, I just, I just kind of go to sleep. You know, it, but it's 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 something I've been doing since like seventh grade, where I just kind of come home from whatever I was doing, and I just go to sleep. It doesn't matter what I was doing. I just go to sleep. Justin, get the mail. All right, you got it. Here's the mail. Okay, I'm going to bed. See ya. <laughs> and you know that's why that, people ask me, where do I get my energy from? And that's that I waste no time going to sleep. I'm always sleeping. My energy is constantly in sleeping. I could be like, I'm like Goldberg. I make my entrance and that's like, call it a day. Boom, I'm going to sleep. See you guys. <laughs> but you know, society doesn't like sleep. That's why there are people out there we just don't get sleep nowadays. They get like two hours of sleep every week and then they'll get paid like minimum wage and then they just kind of just and, and you know, it's just it's just it's absolutely horrible. Well, the episode well, the episode ends in like a few minutes, so like five minutes maybe. Think about what you're missing here. Okay, goodbye that thing. He's a loser. He left us. Can't believe that. Cannot believe he did that. Just me in the world now. Does half so good? Looks like I need more wood. Do I have wood? I think the wood can go all the way around. If I just do that, then I should be good to go. It's it's not a complicated design. It's not much. It's more just something you go into if like you load into the world for the first time overnight and then you just kind of don't have time to make it to the village. This is kind of your escape, you know you Place wood down, and I'm wondering what that thing did over at the village. Because I know at one point, like, if you're wondering why towards the end he wasn't kind of like popping up anymore, he, I do know at one point he asked, like, hey, what's the X coordinate of the village? Because I don't, I don't have a, anything pointing people in the direction of the village just yet. Once the bridge gets closer to Sunset Island, you'll be able to see it, but... I messed up again. Other things. I'm not playing in my room today. I think that's an that's another reason I feel off with this episode. I'm not in my comfort zone. I'm recording this in my basement, which obviously is. I mean, it's kind of better in a way because it's, it's like mother Xbox in my room. It's just a normal. It's like a one freaking one like get like a six year old Xbox. This one's like two years old and it's an Xbox One X. So yeah. It's a little bit more high quality, in a way. And it's on a 4K TV. Not that that makes a difference with Minecraft, but, you know. Alright, gal. I need your beef. You have beef, I want beef, you we we I'm just gonna take your beef. Hey but that thing dude, like I have no idea how much he plays in this world. I kid you not, so the other day I don't have auto renew on my realm turned on. 
because I was on the one month free trial originally and I knew I wasn't keeping that because I was originally going to switch it to the three player realm but the other day my realm expired and he's just and I remember like I woke up one morning and I was, I'm just getting a ton of texts and call, missed calls from him and he's asking like why he can't load into the realm at all so I'm like oh yep gotta renew it <laughs> so he plays on this world a lot like I, I logged on earlier see an enchantment table next to the house I'm like what the frick no he's made more progress in his house and oh don't tell me you've run out of wood fudge there's no trees nearby I've taken all of them um you know nobody's gotta know nobody's gotta know you know, this is just a one-time attraction, you know, you just, oh, but, all right, you know, that's it, I, I'm kind of glad he, I, I was trying to reassure him to stay for the rest of the episode, because, you know, it was almost over, but now, now I realize the episode was not, in fact, not almost over, he dodged the bullet, and I am proud of him for that one, I really applaud him, he did good, he did good. He makes me proud. He makes me proud. Uh, oh, there's trees over there. Good. We are now punching a tree. Some things in Minecraft never change. You're always punching trees. And that's what I find amazing. It might be some so I think another thing that fell off about this video is the fact that I was trying to like talk to that thing despite the fact that you guys had no clue what he was saying and we because we, we I spent like 10 minutes before I started recording trying to figure out why the audio wasn't being included because I had it maybe it was maybe it was privacy settings on his Xbox that's the only thing I can think of or it's something with the Xbox I'm using and not being able to like interact with people in the way I normally can. But you know, I want to be able to finish this house before night falls, but that's, yeah, you know, you can't do anything in this world before night falls. It kind of just falls and it's like, oh, oh well. <laughs> what, do, what do you got? Convince me to save your life. Don't care. Have fun. But yeah. The render distance on Xbox still bothers me. Oh, my God, there's a sunset. What did I say? What did I say? You never get stuff done before nighttime in this world. Nighttime just comes around and you just deal with it. There's a funny story because I, I, I'm playing on this controller right now and I kind of feel, you notice know, how the left some stick feels weird. So, back last year, around November, we started hearing like scratching in the walls and we had no idea what it was. And basically over time we realized there was a mouse hanging out in the walls of the house. And in January that mouse finally had escaped into the house and every now and then he'd poke in, we'd see him, we'd try to chase him down and then he escapes. But one day I come down here to play on the Xbox. And I pick up the left stick, or the controller, I start using put, using the left trigger, left stick, my bad, and all of a sudden I notice it feels weird, and I notice it looks like something started eating the left stick, and I'm, and I'm pretty sure at the time, this is like, by, by the time this had happened actually, I'm pretty sure it was like March, so this is like when COVID, oh my god, this is when like COVID hit my area, 
So we are immediately concerned, like, oh, we should probably um just quickly um sanitize the stuff. Because there really anything remotely unsanitary was, like, going to drive us insane, even if it had no links to COVID at all. So we, I just kind of pick up this controller and notice something ate it. So now this is a missing piece of the controller because my mouse decided to nip away at it. Either that or something else scratched it. I don't know. This is from before I had cats. I wouldn't know. I only got the cats a few months ago. Oh, speaking of them, they're running around upstairs again. That is beautiful. Not the best, but still. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this has been episode 13 of Let's Play Minecraft. If you enjoyed this episode, you have to hit, make sure you hit the buttons necessary because according to YouTube statistics, None of you are freaking subscribed. What is wrong with you guys? This has been episode 13, and I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.